We are making strawberry jam. I have got 300 grams of frozen strawberries. I've got two tablespoons of chia seeds. I've got two tablespoons of sweetener. And I've got my saucepan ready. I am going to start off by adding about four tablespoons of water in my saucepan. I then go ahead and add my frozen strawberries and my sweetener. Once that is in, I am going to cover my saucepan and let that simmer for about 30 minutes. My cooker is on medium heat, so while that is simmering, I tend to check it on intervals and stir and try and crush the strawberries if they are soft, just to make sure that they are cooking through and they are going to be a jam consistency. You want to make sure that your water reduces as much as is possible without leaving the mixture dry so I let that simmer for another five minutes and then I go ahead stir and then I add my chia seeds chia seeds tend to give this mixture a jelly like consistency so you just want the chia seeds to soak into the mixture and um, then they bind it together so giving you like a jam consistency so i am happy with that at this stage and then i go ahead and take that to the side and then i get my handheld blender i've got a glass jar that is clean and ready to store my jam so I then go ahead and blend this mixture together. Once it is cool enough, I'll then place in my clean jar and that's your jam ready. So I was quite excited to try this because I've got my rolls, uh, bread rolls recipe that is just like scones and this jam was really good uh, spread on my bread rolls and um, it, it's just yummy. Uh, it's sweet enough. If you don't like, if you think it could do with a little more sweetness, you can add more sweetener while it is cooking. So it's good to taste your products and add sweetener as you please so that's my bread rolls you can check out uh, the description box for a link to the bread rolls recipe thank you so much for watching please like please share comment and subscribe